This is Car Guys New England, your YouTube channel for anything automotive. This is Car Guys New England, and uh, today we're here at Silver Arrow Service in Londonderry, New Hampshire, and I am finally changing the steering wheel on the Lamborghini. And uh, I am here with Josh of Silver Arrow. What's going on, Josh? Doing good. Awesome. Let's get started. And uh, let's check out this new wheel. It looks well packed. Got some packing peanuts in here and uh, some carbon fiber cleaner and a microfiber cloth. And uh, let's see this bad boy. And we'll just repack the old wheel with this packing stuff once we're uh, once we're done here. Definitely wrap it up tight. Wow, that, that's beautiful. Look at that. Wow, they did a really good job on the carbon, huh? Uh, that matches perfectly, too. Very nice. Cool. Well, uh, let's get started with the install. All right. Hi, this is Josh with Silver Arrow Service. The first thing we're going to do to remove the steering wheel is we're going to disconnect the battery because we are removing the airbag. So you want to make sure that there's no static electricity or anything can get shorted uh, and cause the airbag to go off. So we're going to disconnect the power and then get ready to remove the airbag. Okay. And if we look at the side of the steering wheel, you can see a little cover right here. There's going to be one on each side. So if we pop this cover off, we can see an Allen head screw. So now we're going to unscrew both of these. Take them right out. Now that we got both of those removed, the airbag is just going to pop right out. You can see on the back here we have a couple connections. This one pop out this lock tab and then you'll be able to pull the airbag right off. Whenever you remove an airbag too, it's a good practice to always store it facing up. So if by any chance it does explode, it's not going to become a projectile. It will just blow up and stay where it is rather than this way, it'll go. So now that we have disconnected your airbag and we have disconnected your horn circuit, now we can go in and remove the four bolts that actually secure the wheel to the steering column.
And that's it. So now we can go ahead and grab the new steering wheel and get it all mounted up. So now we're gonna go ahead and install the new steering wheel. We have our four bolts, which you'll notice little remnants of some blue Loctite. So we have our Permatex thread locker blue. So as we put the bolts in, we're gonna put little dabs on each one. It's very important that when you put the steering wheel on, you want to pull all your wires through to make sure that nothing gets pinched or caught where it shouldn't. You want to make sure you don't tighten these fully because there is a little bit of movement in the steering wheel. So if you torque it down tight, then you won't be able to move it and there's a chance you might not be able to get the rest of the bolts in. So you want to get them all in and started and then tighten them up evenly afterwards. So now that we have the steering wheel all on, we've tightened all our bolts. We're gonna go ahead and reconnect everything. So we'll connect the horn there. We'll connect the horn here. And then we can go ahead and reconnect our airbag. Again, it is very important to make sure that you disconnect the battery whenever working on any SRS components. Now that we have that in, we can take our bolts. We're going to put a little bit of blue Loctite on these as well.
now that these are nice and tight and reinstall our covers and that completes the installation of a carbon fiber steering wheel on the Lamborghini LP640 and that looks beautiful absolutely beautiful in here very nice so the whole reason that I was replacing this wheel, you can actually see that it was suede and all the suede wore off. So it looked like absolute dog shit, uh, especially, you know, up in here and, uh, you know, over here, you can see where it just wore off. looks like crap. But anyways, this is going to be getting packed up and uh, this will be going back uh, to MA Carbon so they can make this into another beautiful wheel for another uh, customer. Now that we've repackaged the steering wheel all back up, make sure you have your core return paperwork in the box and you're ready to seal it up, put the return label on and send it back. And that is how you change a wheel in a Lamborghini Murcielago LP640, folks. Uh, anyways, we're going to be sending the original wheel back. That's all packed up and ready to go. So we'll go to the local FedEx uh, hub to send that off where MA Carbon will uh, end up redoing that wheel for another customer into a beautiful wheel. Uh, anyways, thank you very much for watching this video. Be sure to give it a like if you like the video. If you have comments or questions, be sure to comment down below. This is Car Guys New England. Until next time, take care.